All right, guys. Uh, welcome to uh, Semantic Backup Exec tutorial. Uh, today, I'll be uh, showing how to change the Backup Exec logon account or the services account. Most of the uh, times, we face issues with services, uh, the logon account. So we have to create a secondary a backup admin account, which is a part of a local admin group or your domain admin. And again, uh, we have to change account okay first you have to launch the uh, the user interface and after that and uh, the current version is 2015 semantic backup exec okay and uh, you have to click on this icon which is there on the left top corner and uh, click on configuration and settings and now we have something called backup exec services and login accounts okay click on login accounts Click on Manage Logon Accounts. See, so this is the the current one. It says a System Logon Account. So what I can do is click on Add, and I can mention whichever, let's say my uh, test account, which is already under the Active Directory. Okay, Test Admin, and type your password, and uh, retype your password and mention whatever it is and uh, you can select this is my default account uncheck this is a restricted login account okay and then it will become my default account once you click on ok it will change all your backup jobs all your services will use this as a default login account so this is where you will change the uh, login account management currently i'm not changing because uh, I'm, this is a test so and the other way and also you can also uh, test that account okay and if you click on system login account this is the same you can also change your password if if you i mean by mistake if you change the password on the ad level or on the uh, system level you can come and modify here click on change password okay and and the other thing is how you will change the backup exec services account okay normal normal way uh, people most of us uh, will what we'll do is we'll go to the uh, services.msc and we will try to change the services right the uh, the backup exec services right currently it's showing as see the local admin what we'll do is we will go to properties Okay, click on log on and we will modify here, right? So you have to do it for all the services here and you have to restart the service to take the effect, which is not a right way because we don't know with, there are a lot of dependencies between those services. So, and the right way to do is open the uh, backup exec uh, user interface, click on this icon, go to configuration and settings. Under that we have backup exec services, click on that. So this is where it will list all your services, okay? And it shows your account name and the service name. For that, you, what you have to do is just click on Edit Credentials and you can click on Old Username, Old Password, New Username, New Password and also you can also change the startup options automatic and everything. Ensure that Grant Required Rights to Service Account, this should be checked, okay? And once you change it, click on OK. You have to restart all services here. OK. Then only it will take effect. So this is the right way to actually change the account on the uh, backup exec services. So guys, uh, stay tuned for more tutorials. And thank you so much for watching. And uh, please subscribe to my channel. Thank you and have a nice day.